welcome back to a new video. I'm so sorry if it's like echoing here, but I'm going to be showing you my skincare routine and just what I do when I want a little pamper for my skin. This has been a really like requested video. I've done so many skincare videos to be honest in the past and a lot of the products that I've mentioned I still use till today. So I'll link some of those videos in the info box. This video is going to be focused on some products that I've really been enjoying lately and just what I like to do to give my skin that extra moisture and care because my skin's really really dry um, especially in winter time. I do have hyperpigmentation that comes out here and there. It goes and comes when it wants. Some It depends with the season and like what I eat and stuff. It's so weird. I mostly get it here and on my cheeks. Um, sometimes a little bit around my eye area but it's not that much. Um, I do focus on skin texture as well. I'm starting to get pores and um, yeah just like bumpiness which to be honest has improved so much i have been taking my perfecto hair crush gummies for the past two months now and to be honest i've just been really happy with them they're so easy to incorporate in my everyday routine phytobiotics is actually the uk's number one supplement brand and these specific gummies have 21 carefully selected vitamins and nutrients and it's just it's just so easy to have like everything in one kind of vitamin um, so I don't have to take various tablets or anything. These have no artificial sweeteners, they're vegan friendly, there's no preservatives. These are meant to help maintain normal hair, skin and nails so I love that it helps a bit of everything and one thing I've noticed, I do have acrylics on right now though, but one thing I've noticed when I did have like my gel on and just my nails there was no chipping. Normally, like, my nails always break. But since I've been taking these, I think after, like, six weeks or so, I've noticed no chipping. So I'm really, really happy with this because normally my nails peel as well. Um, so I've definitely seen results there. And overall, my, nail, my hair feels just luscious and full. I don't know. There's just something. I just feel like my skin and my hair is getting the support it needs. I don't think I can part ways with this ever. Um, I keep one in my bag and just have them with my lunch. It's important to take um, some with your main meal and I take three with my lunch. Yeah, I just wanted to give you an update from my previous video because I've just been loving these and I just think it's helped overall like since we are talking about skin today, I just feel like it's just given that extra care, just love and care for my skin. And not to forget, I just love the taste of them. It's so weird. It's like a little treat that I get to have in the day. And with that, I get all the nutrients I need. So yes, yeah, it's just a win-win, guys. Now let's move on to skincare products. Um, let's put my hair back. Do you guys take vitamins at all? Let me know in the comments below. I want to know because I haven't been taking any before I started these hair crush gummies and I have to be honest like I'm really pleased. It, I'm just happy that I'm doing something to help my body from within you know. Okay hair's tied back. Do I look weird? Do I look weird? <laughs> The first thing I love is the Neutrogena um, Hydro Boost Cleanser. It's like a water gel cleanser, it foams up, but it doesn't make my skin feel dry afterwards and it removes all makeup, like it just removes everything. So effortlessly I don't really need to use a cleansing oil. Um, sometimes I do use cleansing oil, so I definitely recommend you guys um, check out my Instagram where I post so many like um, skincare videos and you can see like what kind of other products I like to use because I really have to strip down on the products that I just love and always reach for um, but I do switch up my skincare a lot not only is it part of my job to like test and try out so many products but um, I like I love skincare and I love switching it up and just trying different things on my skin but these are just things I feel like I need to recommend to you guys and you guys need to know about so yeah I if you don't have this I definitely recommend you guys getting this like ASAP I hope I swear down I can't I feel like I've just bought over 20 bottles of these they need to do like a maxi size it's just amazing I love this I cannot live without this I'm gonna wash my face with this right now so as you can see it foams and it smells really fresh and honestly when I come back from work and stuff I have a full face of makeup I just wet my face um, with warm water I put this on and it just wipe it just removes everything so it's really quick and easy to use 
Next thing that I literally swear by, so you know the I have these like marks here right now. Um, I've had so many like scars from like spots and zits and stuff. Um, but they always I always make them go because I use a dermal roller. Basically, these are like it's a roller with little uh, needles on it, but it doesn't hurt or anything. But what it does, it kind of like damages the first layer of the skin. So that it kind of like forces it to heal and like new skin surfaces up. Surfaces up. I have done a full video on this, so I'll link it in the info box. Um, so like I have scarring here, so I'm just gonna focus it on that. I just go up sideways, and that's it really. And I always focus on my pigmentation area because again, it's gonna like make the skin renew itself, and it's just really good for exfoliation scarring especially and hyperpigmentation i just think i swear by this i really do so i just do roughly all over one thing i love to do when i'm doing like a pamper i just love to like do a quick mask today we're going to go for this milo mask and because we've done the derma planning the mask is really going to sink into the skin this feels really creamy Alright, I'm going to leave this for 10 minutes and I'll be right back. Right, it's now time to take this off. So with this mask, you don't need to rinse off. Mm. That feels so nice already. Oh my god. Honestly, I just like, I, sometimes I just love sitting down on my bed with the TV on and just like take my time and put the mirror on the bed and I just do like... My whole skincare routine is just so satisfying and it feels amazing. It's always important to like take care of yourself, you know? I've even got my husband into like skincare and stuff and he's obsessed with Before he used to just put Nivea cream. <laughs> right, now we're gonna go on to, we're gonna put a serum. That's the, f after like a mask, I always like to go in with a serum. The one I've been loving lately is the Estee Lauder is the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair. It's like a recovery complex. This is definitely like a luxe product. Some of the products that were sent to me, um, some were, I've just repurchased, um, but this is really nice. I just press that into my skin. So normally when I'm not masking, um, I go in with a toner, I forgot to mention my toner. I've been loving the Ulla Henriksen toner. This is the Glow um, Dark Spot Toner. I love Ulla Henriksen. Definitely one I would like repurchase any day. This is definitely a luxe product, but this will last me ages. And yeah, I, I don't mind investing my skincare, so I see myself getting this. Um, so yeah, I love this. And it, the toner is actually quite affordable. I think it's around £20, but this is really good. And I love that it targets dark spots. Um, I put this at night, mainly, so this whole routine is mostly night time by the way, if I am ever doing a full pamper. Um, so yeah, um, with a cotton pad and just swipe it over, it smells amazing as well. To be honest, my morning routine is only literally like moisturiser, uh, eye cream and SPF. Um, if you're using products like these, you definitely need to always wear SPF. Um, so that's why I don't do a morning routine because like I don't really go in with my skincare in the morning I'm just quick but when I want to do like a pamper or, or even just at night that's why I really focus on my skincare I've actually also been loving this nip and fab scrub it's a vitamin C scrub fix it's almost finished but I've been loving this definitely need to repurchase it but it's just doing the job to like exfoliate my skin I don't use as much acids as before to be honest and I just think it's been helping I think it was too uh, abrasive for my skin and yeah like I'd get less flakiness as well um, so this does a job to just exfoliate and make sure my skin's super soft and it has vitamin C which helps to uh, illuminate the skin surface so I have been loving this, I'm not using it today, but I thought I'd recommend it to you guys. Next thing is moisturizer and eye cream. So I'm gonna do my eye cream first. I have been loving the Visha Skincare Advanced Bright Eye B. 
booster and there is so much in here this will last me ages I actually do like um, Vicious Skincare because it's made by a, an actual doctor. Um, maybe most skincare. I feel like this is really targeted to like pigmentation and stuff like that. So I've been loving it and I feel like it has been helping my under eyes. Um, I haven't, I want to put it more on my over lids because now I feel like my lids are darker than my under eyes. So I've been trying to like um, focus there a bit more but I just put a bit... If you guys know of good eye creams, definitely let me know that have like really worked for you. Now onto moisturizer, I have been loving the Ulla Henriksen one. This is the Nurture Me Moisturizing Cream. So this was actually sent to me, but I bought another one because I loved it that much. Um, and I also do really like the Ulla Henriksen Truth Sea Rush Brightening Gel Cream. This is like a little sample that I have, but it's not as moisturizing as the Nurture Me one. Um, but I'm going to use this but I won't be, it's more for like oily skin I feel like if you just want a water based moisturiser. Just take a little bit, you don't need too much moisturiser, really press it into the skin. Some other creams that I really like is the Nip and Fab Renew Retinol Fix Day Cream. I also use the night cream. They're affordable and they have been really good. They're really moisturising so I love these. Then after my moisturiser I like to finish it with an oil. There's so many oils that I love guys. Um, today I'm going to be using the Ret uh, Revolution one. This is their Night Restore Oil. I've only started using this. Another one I like is the Kiehl's uh, Midnight Recovery Concentrate. This is amazing. And I've also been loving the Honest Beauty Facial Oil. It smells amazing and you can get this in boots, I think. This is really nice, but I'm gonna go in with the Revolution one. It feels so lush and it's affordable. I like to just like warm it up in my hands first, like two to three drops. press it into my skin and another product that I actually I don't think I can se like separate from ever is the Murad hydration night fix enzyme treatment um I'm looking in the mirror to like read it off it's, some of these products have such long names this is something that you can put as your last last step so it says to apply uh, apply after moisturizer um, as the last step of your nighttime regimen and it smells amazing. So I'm just going to put this on. I can't, I wish you guys can like get your hands through the camera and feel my face, although that would be really creepy. But my, food, my skin feels so soft guys. I've been um, enjoying this uh, Colourpop lippy scrub um, this is their matcha love one. Take a little bit. It's exfoliate and it's, it tastes really yum, but let's just not eat our skincare, guys. Let's just not eat our skincare. I just ate it. My friend actually made me discover this Mario Badescu lip balm. It's, I think I found the best lip balm, guys. It smells like coconut. It's so hydrating. I... I'm obsessed with this. And lastly, just for that little extra oomph, I'm gonna go in with this Nip and Fab Vitamin C Essence Mist. Just put the hair out of the way. It smells so lush. All right, guys, that's the end of this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Just one last product that I just love, I just love this product so much, is the Kiehl's Ultra Facial Overnight Hydrating Mask. It's so lush. Whenever my skin's flaky or super dry, I sleep with this on and it's just, my skin just wakes up like plump and moisturized. I'm not gonna use it today, but you can tell I'm halfway through it. I love this stuff, so definitely recommend it and again it's something that I would be purchased for sure that was gifted but um, I love it so yeah I hope you guys enjoy this video I'll leave a link for the vitamins in the info box if you guys are interested and all the products will be linked as well if you guys want to check them out 
and yeah thank you so much guys for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you in my next video bye close up of the skin